Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. I'm gonna show you guys how I edit my Instagram reels. I've literally been asked by everyone's mother, cousin, uncle, kidding. Um, but I've literally been asked by a lot of people how I edit my reels, so I'm gonna show you guys. The style of reels I'm gonna show you guys today is basically these reels that I love to do. Um, it's just so quick and easy. It's very like, kind of like captivating to me, um, making them. I love making those kind of reels because it's just like short, sweet, and also the, uh, it also favors the Instagram algorithm. Um, if you guys are not following me on Instagram, I'm gonna leave my out on the screen. Definitely go over there and check out um, the videos. You probably get a better idea of what I'm meaning, but I'm gonna basically show you guys how I edit this green, oh my God, I'm gonna close the, Door. Now that we have no distraction, I'm basically going to show you guys how I edit this reel that I recently did. I posted it on my Instagram and honestly so many people are asking me um, how I edited it. It's something that has been done before, it's easy. Um, basically gonna make your life easy. Um, hopefully you guys can use this video over and over again. You can um, replay if you don't um, get what I'm saying in the video, literally just feel free to go back. The videos that I love, um, the video length that I love doing is um, about five seconds to 10 second reels. So the video today I'm gonna be doing is, um, I want it to be eight second. Um, so I use this app called Splice. I'm just gonna start screen recording my phone. It's a free app. All you have to do is just download it on the app store and it's free. It does it does have in in inside purchase, but don't worry about that, just click X. So the video I am gonna upload. So what I like to do, I like to go on my camera roll, favorite everything. When I'm shooting, uh, I do this, and then when I come back home, I will go through all my videos and then I will re-favorite or favorite them again. So the video I'm gonna um, edit today is this one. I already um, favorited. So um, on Splice, it will basically tell you um, whether you wanna upload your TikTok, Instagram Reels, Instagram Story, Instagram Post, or YouTube widescreen. This basically is going to, um, it's going to change the ratio of your video. So I always click on Instagram Reels. Um, I also upload my reels on TikTok. If you guys are not following me on there, I'll leave my out on the screen. But I always upload my Instagram reels sometimes on TikTok, and I still I just go with one edit. So I always just use the Instagram reel. And for story content, um, I still just use the Instagram reel because it's just one video. I don't want to re-edit the video, so I just I just use the Instagram. Um, Reels, so yeah, it will tell you like um, ready to become a splicer. Just click X at the top, and then it will start loading, and that will be your video uploaded. So with Splice, you can um, select different kinds of videos to edit, and it will all come into here. And this is where you can also like put different kind of visit videos together. But today, I'm just going to show you guys how I edit this video and basically how I slow down my videos in in between. Um, so with this, the video is 12 seconds long. Um, I always love going through the video and looking at my attitude, looking at how I look, um, because you wanna basically cut it where um, it's kind of, like you wanna capture, you want someone to replay it, so you wanna cut it where you're feeling your best or you just, it's just like a captivating moment, do you know what I mean? Um, you yourself, you will know, but you will just have to like go through the video and do that. So that's why I advise you guys to just record 12 seconds. Um, so it's so much easier for you to just cut the video. Um, so I always mute all clips. Um, Splice is so easy to use. They've got various things. You can also put text on Splice, but I go in and I, play the video like slowly um, where I want to cut it. With this video, I did want to like start it where it already started, but I realized 12 seconds was too long, so I needed to condense it down. So I'm gonna cut it just before I start walking. Um, there we go. 
and you tap on the screen and it will be i literally did that so quickly it's because i'm so used to like editing but i'm gonna do that again so at the top you can go back and it will basically go back to the last edit that you did um so with the video when you tap on it it goes blue um tap on it and then it will come up with option split unmute extract replace um replace is basically if you want to like replace the whole video you can it will take you to your camera roll and put another video um this is when you are creating like different various clips in one video but with this video we don't really need that so i click split at the top um just before i start walking and then um i play the video through um so i like how i look when um just before i touch my hair um i split there again and then i split where i flicked my hair and then i watched the whole video and it's too long of me walking away so i'm going to just cut it before i touch my bag um so yeah okay maybe i can so at the end so so because all the videos are all split into different um things you can't actually move the video like instead of like clicking split you can just actually move the video from the end um or like the front um so yeah i'm just kind of like reducing the video a little bit yeah so i'm gonna cut it here as i walk away um so that was seven seconds at the front i don't like i feel like that was like too long so i'm gonna just take it in slightly just before i start walking and now the video is seven seconds long I i'm gonna play it for you guys um so that's how it looks like that's like the original um perfect so i then go in so where i want to slow down the video is basically when i'm like looking away uh, yeah when i'm looking away so you can go on speed at the bottom all the videos right now is um times one um which is like a hundred percent um yeah 100% um, but I want to take it down to 0.5 so I always take it down to 0.5 or 0.6 and then just play the video see how it looks like this is how it's going to look like and then just walk away <laughs> um, and that's how I slow down the video and all you have to do now is click save at the top save on full hd um 1080 um this is good for instagram because it does keep with the it does keep with the quality um if you do it ultra 4k it does the thing is with instagram when you upload um really high quality images or high quality videos it dims it down because it's like confused and it doesn't know how to like react so if you guys want high quality video definitely download on full hd um 1080p always so i save that and that will just go on my camera roll and um it will give you the option to post it on instagram tiktok or snapchat basically where you want to post it but i never really use that i love to upload directly onto instagram i'm gonna show you guys the final video here Um, it looks like at the end I love this kind of editing um, video uh, it's just so quick and easy and also splice is mobile so I could literally um, edit anywhere I want I also edit sometimes on iMovie if you guys want to see that let me know down below let me know in the comments what you guys want to see next and if you guys are not subscribed to my channel make sure you are and I will see you guys on my next video